Hi guys, welcome back to FTB Infinity Skyblock. Oh yeah, guys. So um, in the last episode, we attempted to get ourselves a um, Wither Star, Nether Star. That's it. Uh, but we uh, we failed, and I think the reason is uh, because the chamber was probably one block too small. So now we're gonna have to go ahead and take back the last millennium um, because there's an awful lot of reinforced stone and stuff in there that I really want back. Um, so we're gonna have to tool up for this. So today we're gonna basically start getting tooled up. There's two things that I need to do. Firstly, um, I've actually realized something about this contraption, but anyway, uh, firstly, we are going to want to get ourselves some sort of enchantments uh, so that we can enchant our armor and stuff. Um, and later when we get better armor as well, we'll be able to um, enchant that. So I actually figured out today that these fuzzy ones... Can I clear it like this? No. So these fuzzy ones just ignore MBT, but if we put a stick in it, oh, was walnut a recipe? Okay, so if we uh, grab this stick here, if we put, here's the other one, if we put this in here and take off the fuzzy off it, fine. But if we put a stick in here, ignore its metadata. This is actually the one I've been wanting to use to pull all this armor and stuff out, but I don't want to pull this armor out anymore. So soulbound, yeah, we're gonna want soulbound and all this stuff. So. Uh, we do want it to ignore MBT. Do we? Uh, we might want to ignore MBT. But anyway, we're going to pull this out here so that we don't... Um, so we aren't just dumping this stuff anymore. We're going to actually take this stuff and we're going to put it in an auto disenchanter. Um, because I think that is a good idea. Um, of course, yeah, what does it need? It just needs... This isn't the one that needs mob essence, no. Cool. So we can actually make most of this already because we've made one of these before. They're easy enough to make. Um, so we should be able to... Another brick, books, yeah. It's gonna require two machine chassis, wow. Uh, that's that might take a while of crafting, but anyway, um, they should be ready to go though almost No Yeah, cool, so that's that and then all we need is that nether brick Oh, we only have one nether rack Okay, so we can actually get that as well, which is no problem. Just as soon as we get... Uh, well, it has to craft first, obviously. Okay, let me just craft up this disenchanter, because everything else we have, um, we just have to get this. Alright, so I have myself an auto disenchanter. Uh, which is what we were trying to craft, of course. Um, so let's put it here for now. So this thing, yeah, it doesn't, it needs power, firstly, but that's fine. There's so much power down there. Uh, it needs books, which is actually what we're going to do right now. We're going to hook up some logistics pipes right here. Uh, right here, actually, is probably handier. So let's pull out, uh, oh wait, there should be one, 
over here. Let's just drop down here. Aha! This way. There's one here. Perfect. Uh, so, on route is there. And a supplier there. And we'll just get this... Oh! We'll get it supplying um, books to there. So, let's get an MV hooked up here. Uh, right here should be fine. Uh, oh, will that reach? I think that should be fine. Yeah, there we go. So that's power, and we have books hooked up now. Or we will have books in a minute. Let's, uh, oh no, I fell down. I'm glad there was no void there. Okay. So let's grab a book. I've taught this how to make books. It's making it from the wood. So it's very, very... Wood and string is all it's using. Um, which is fine. Because we have a load of string. Uh, oh, right. We were actually out of lava. So um, it actually took ages for that to get the nether rack. So there's a book. So. Let's open up this. And supply this infinitely oh I hope this puts it into the right place it shouldn't take too long to craft right Uh, we'll turn this on to repeat as well. So let's, um, we're going to use retrieval nodes here um, because I think it's probably make this easier because we also want to pull out, we want to pull out, oh, th I just saw books going in there. Yeah, they're going into the right place. Sweet. Hopefully it doesn't try to fill up here as well. Um, e. Okay, so let's grab something here. We'll grab the chest plate here. Um, I have one that is ignoring metadata and one that's using ignoring MBT and meta. So this one is the one we want. Is it? Yeah. So let's put that in there and we'll put this in here for now and we'll hook it up. Okay, so this should... That should be fine now. Loads of books. So this should pull that out. Uh, and I will attempt to pull the enchantments off this. And hopefully this does it right. Um, and then we're going to have ourselves a filing cabinet that is going to have all the enchanted books in it. Cool. So there's the enchanted book and there's the um, thing. So let's... We're actually going to need a second retrieval node, I think. Damn. Um, although, actually, I'm fairly certain that if we put this right... Oh, no. No, no, no. Not there. Come back. Ah. Oh. I should have probably figured this out a bit better before we started this, but let's let's put this here. We're gonna put this right here, and you can see I already put some books in here. So if we pull off, uh, actually we can just grab. Oh, it should be in the system. Transfer node. So this is pulling from here. So, we want to pull this like this, so that will go to there. Uh, it can't put, like this can't put that in there. So what we want to do then is get it a, um, a trash can that will uh, be one further. Uh, 
Um, uh, no, no, no. Oh, damn. I think I just lost that one. Okay. Uh, we want to put it here. That's a unrooted, so that's fine. Yeah. Uh, no. I just put it there, didn't I? I have to stop putting these things... Okay, let's put one of these here, just so it will stop connecting. Here, okay, there we go, now it's working. Uh, and then we'll put this here. There we go. So then, they should drop off the books here first before putting them in the trash can. But we can always put a filter in the trash can, actually. That would have been easier to do. Yeah. Uh, ignore meta. Yeah, we might. I might set it up that way. But let's uh, just grab another one of these for now. Let's grab the golden leggings. And let's let it go. It'll take a while. Uh, so this will has what? Protection on it? Protection too, yeah. Grant. Uh, we're also gonna put... Like, this machine won't take... Bees, will it? Okay. So then, this should pull out this as well and it's disenchanting the bows now and the protection book has gone in there now sweet and the rest has been dumped out of the system which is fine that's exactly what we want so this will have a uh, power one and unbreaking one and it should try pulling both of those the um both of these are pretty cool i've never seen the xp boost one the soulbound one is is what we want we want to get a load of soulbound books as well so cool this has taken the power book off. Or I'm breaking. Yeah. And now we'll take the power off. And hopefully this is got a bow in it, right? Oh, auto smelt. What an OP. That is like, seriously, if you're ever playing with auto smelt and... Um, what is it? Auto smelt and fortune. It just, it goes crazy. So that pulled out the golden leggings. I want to see if the golden leggings will come into this. Which they don't. Right. So we have to get rid of the, um, the plane stuff as well somehow. So I'll have to deal with that as well. Okay, let me just figure out, uh, play around with these um, nodes and uh, we'll come back in a second. Cool, so uh, I have it pretty much set up. I have another retrieval node here, just retrieving the non stuff. I don't know if that's going to work or not, but we're getting some books. Um, protection ones are what we're going to need anyway. Uh, soul band will be nice. And yeah, so now we need something to put these on. So um, I was looking at the flux infused stuff. I think this is probably the best thing to use, but I'm not sure. Um, it's fairly easy to make. I think I already have most of the stuff. These. No, okay, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to put all of this in. Oh, we might have to set this thing up on... Uh, yeah, okay, that's okay, we can use that. Pyrothium, redstone, electrum. Easy enough. Uh, we have loads... Oh, no! Oh, no! <laughs> Face Pam. Oh, I put the retrieval node onto this trash can and it deleted the four 
tesseracts that I had here. Oh. Wow. Okay. Right. Anyway, uh, let's just craft a couple of these things. Some of these things. Some of these things. And it should probably be enough. Oh, that's... Oh, that just... That's just super annoying. <laughs> okay. So, what's that recipe? Two electrum, two redstone, one pyrothium. Uh, two redstone, two electrum. And a pyrothium dust once that comes. That. That. Okay, cool. Um, I want to shove this in here. I've done something wrong. It's four redstone, isn't it? Okay, there we go. That's perfect. Uh, we'll grab these and we'll probably set up an active supplier so that we on a uh, compressing drawer so that we can get the ingots as well. And uh, once I have a drawer full of those, we'll uh, we'll uh, get some of this armor stuff going. Okay, so we should have everything we need now to craft these things. So uh, let's see if it works. And there we have five of these things, and there is the helm. Oh, now we need some way of charging this thing. Uh, wireless charger, maybe? This charger. Yeah, this thing. We need a ender resonator. I don't think I have an enderman head yet. Interesting. Should be easy enough to get, though. Powered light, powered light. How about a charging pad? Health pad, charge pad. Uh, reinforced machine frame. How about the resonant charge pad? Yeah, okay. Um, I'm going to grab the beheader over here. If we turn off this, we can go in there and just... This thing. Should be able to um, get ourselves a couple of ender heads. Cool, so I just made an energetic infuser instead. I will make a wireless charger in a minute. Probably after this episode, but cool. So we have a flux infused helm. And we should be able to put, like protection or something on this so let's find ourselves a nice protection three uh, is there protection four I can never remember uh, protection blast protection no that's fine uh, so I have a thingy up here uh, because we need levels, of course. So there's another protection. Th did that just... Oh, yeah, okay. Protection four. Is protection five a thing? I don't remember. Again. <laughs> so this should be able to put this on here. Sweet. Cool. So there is protection four. Perfect. And so let's put these back in here. Cool. So I'm going to make up the rest of the armor now and uh, we'll hopefully be back if it's not too difficult. I think maybe the f chest plate requires some differences. No, no, it doesn't. Grand. Okay, I'll be back in a sec. 
Okay, so there's the last piece of this uh, stuff. Uh, and you'll notice that once I take it out, I've actually I've made myself a wireless charger. I uh, While I was waiting for this stuff to craft, I just went in there with the beheader and just started hacking stuff off there. So we're going to wait. have to wait until we need, get some more protection books before we can enchant ourselves protection. Uh, full protection on this thing. Um, I'm not sure if we need anything else. I want to put soul bound on some of it, all right, for sure. And I, I'm not sure if I can enchant this stuff with soul bound, but uh, that might be an idea as well. The sword, anyway. This rest of the stuff we won't be bringing back to take back. But uh, I've made up these armor stands as well, so I can shift left click onto them and uh, do their armor because there's a redstone block underneath them. Um, so yeah, so I have myself some flux infused armor. It looks pretty cool. So the next thing I want to do with that is to upgrade it to this. Ye, jet infused or flux infused jet plate, um, which needs jelly cryothium, which I don't have, so it's just not gonna happen. Damn. Uh, We need blizzes, and I don't know how to get blizz powder. Oh, we can infuse snowballs. And how do we get snowballs? Witchery plants do it. This stuff here, blizz rods. No, we can't make blizz rods. Okay, so we can infuse snowballs. Uh, oh, of course, the uh, there's a, a machine to make snowballs. That's fine, we can do that. Okay guys, so we're gonna wait until next episode to do that. Uh, sorry this is kind of a bit weird episodes. Um, this one and probably the next one as well, we're kinda just gonna tool up and get ready to fight the wither on our own, rather than having all sorts of awesome automated ways of doing it. But anyway guys, I'm gonna leave it there, and I will see you next time.